Welcome to Premath. In this video, we have got these uh, bunch of rectangles uh, put together as you can see in this uh, diagram such that the area of this uh, green rectangle is uh, 52 centimeters square. The area of this uh, blue is uh, 60 centimeters square. Likewise, this blue is 60 centimeters square as well. The area of this uh, purple rectangle is 56 uh, centimeters square. And finally, the area of this uh, yellow rectangle is uh, 232 centimeters square. And moreover, the vertical uh, side length uh, of this uh, green uh, rectangle is uh, 6 uh, centimeters. And now our task is to calculate uh, this uh, side length uh, x. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. Please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started. And since uh, we are dealing with this uh, sticky kind of problem, so therefore we are going to think uh, outside the box and we are going to apply this uh, very simple uh, concept. Here we got uh, these uh, two rectangles. The area of this uh, yellow rectangle is uh, A. The area of this uh, blue rectangle is uh, B along with their respective uh, side lengths uh, A and uh, B respectively. Then the ratio of their area is going to be equal to the ratio of their uh, side length. And now let's revert our attention back to our problem. Let's focus on uh, these uh, rectangles at the bottom. And now let's focus on these uh, two rectangles combined. Their area is going to be 60 plus uh, 52. So their combined uh, area turns out to be 112 centimeters square. Now let's make an observation. We can see this 112 is uh, twice this uh, area of this uh, purple rectangle, which is uh, 56. So therefore, we got a ratio of uh, 1 to 2. And here's our next step. I have divided this uh, yellow rectangle into two parts uh, by drawing this uh, red uh, horizontal line, as you can see. And we can see that this uh, side uh, length uh, is the uh, same as uh, this uh, side length. So therefore, uh, the ratio of this uh, side length uh, to this one is going to be twice of uh, that one. If this is 60, then we are going to multiply this 60 by 2. That is going to give us uh, 120. So therefore, uh, this part of this uh, yellow rectangle turns out to be 120 centimeter square. And we know that the whole area for this uh, yellow rectangle is 232. So therefore, uh, this uh, part uh, has an area 232 minus 120 that is going to give us uh, 112. So therefore we conclude that this uh, partial uh, rectangle uh, turns out to be 112 centimeters square. And now let's go ahead and compare uh, this uh, rectangle and this uh, big uh, rectangle as well. Both have the area same 112 over here and 112 over here as well. And moreover, this uh, side length uh, is uh, exactly same as uh, this uh, side uh, length. So therefore, we conclude that this uh, side length uh, has got to be exactly same as uh, this one. If this is a 6, uh, this x is going to be equal to 6 centimeter as well. So thus we conclude that this uh, side length uh, x uh, turns out to be 6 centimeter. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.